Hey guys, in today's video, I want to show you how to use the new eSIM feature built into the new iPhones 10s, 10s Max, and 10R. For those of you that don't know, the new eSIM features, the new electronic SIM card feature built into the new iPhones and allows you to add additional data without having to insert a physical SIM card to your device. Now, there's a few ways to do this. Today, I'm going to be showing you with GeekSky World Mobile Data. Now, they allow you to purchase data, activate the eSIM feature directly on your device. They have over 190 countries, five regions. They have great coverage no contracts no data caps so it's on the go it's really really useful links will be in the description for the application once you set it up uh, you can go ahead and set up create an account creating an account it's completely free you see here that I can tap on the United States region where I'm at currently which covers America right here covers Canada Mexico Puerto Rico and you see there the US Virgin Islands and of course the United States but if we go to more countries here or change destination you can see I can graph data for over 190 countries so if you're out and about and you need additional data on your device you don't have to go finding a carrier for additional uh, data you can just right then and there activate it on your device it's really simple to set up as well let me go ahead and show you so let's go ahead and say i want to go ahead and add uh 300 megabytes here so just click buy of course i've already set up my account and all that and simply add to plan or buy right here and it's going to take me through some instructions on how to set it up on my device and i'm going to show you how to set it up here it's relatively easy once the uh, whole setup is completed you can activate the dual sim feature and just simply use the data as easy as that so right here we go let's go ahead and follow these instructions right here it says set custom label to gig sky 4 for secondary and i'll explain that here in a few seconds and then select the data only option so we're going to click copy label right here and that's going to copy the label right here gig sky plan 4 to our clipboard and then install cellular plan click continue and once we click continue it's going to bring us to set it up so let's go ahead and set that up right here add cellular plan and right here as you see secondary so under secondary we're going to go ahead and add the label to custom labels here right there click paste because remember we uh, copied it earlier and then click done now once you click done you want to click continue and right here is where you're going to select uh, use data only so right here use gig sky plan for cellular data only so we're going to tick on that and click done and let's go ahead and head on back to the settings application and now when we go under the cellular data options you see that i have my primary line and by the way that's not an active phone number so so i have the primary line that's going to be the phone number and everything and then i have the data plan which is activated right here and you can see that i have the additional data on my device lte is enabled everything is ready to go so right now the phone is using gig sky as you see there for data and since i don't have an active line on this device for phone calls it says no service but there it is dual sim card support e-support with gig sky i hope you guys enjoyed this video tutorial thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next one peace